In this video, I'm going to show you how to recover your hacked Facebook account without any email, phone number or any password. Just using only your name. Once a hacker hack your Facebook account, immediately he will change your all login details and recovery method. After you will be automatically logged out from Facebook. So now on, you have no longer access to that account. And also, before we jump into the video, it is better if you can follow these instructions. When you are recovering your Facebook account, you have to try with your same location. Don't use any VPN application or GPS changer application. As well as you can use the same internet or Wi-Fi connection. If you want, you can switch between your mobile data to Wi-Fi. As well as you have to use the same application. Not like the past, Facebook tracks every step of your recovery process. So, it is better if you can same application that you used to log in in the past. You can use original Facebook application, Facebook Lite or Messenger application. Then, it is better if you can use your old device. As well as, this is not like any other process. You can't go through this process multiple times. You will be spam. Only go through this process 2-3 times and recover your account. As well as I invite you to watch the full tutorial before you start with me. After watching full video, get the full idea, then you can do your own. If you can follow this simple instruction, you will never get that error message. Okay, without any further ado, let's jump into the video. To start, open your Facebook application. Because this is the application which have all past login details in their saved data and the cache memory. After opening, you will get this interface. Here you have to select forgot password option. But if you have your old account, just select that account. After it will ask password, then select forget password option. Sometime Facebook will ask some permission. Here allow all these permission to confirm or track this account really belongs to you. On the next page, you have several options. Either you can try your phone number, email address or your account name. First, it is better if you can give a try with your phone number. Somehow, if you can't find your Facebook account with your phone number or hacker already changed your phone number, then you can move to the second option. Search by email instead. Then to take a try with your email address, tap search by your email instead at the bottom then it will come to the top now as the second option enter your old email address if hacker change your email too you can move to the third option try out with your full facebook name definitely this third option will work for you even hacker change your facebook name you can try out with your account id if you want to know how to recover your Facebook just using your Facebook ID, you can find that video in my how to recover Facebook account playlist. I will put that link in this video description too. The real reason first I ask you to try out with your phone number or email address, Facebook tracks every movement of this recovery process. So you have to make them trust. By the way, if you have no any other option, just enter your Facebook name or ID. Then tap find your account. After searching your name, Facebook will suggest list of accounts which have same name. Most probably the first one is yours. But unfortunately, if you can't find your account within this list, you can scroll all the way to the bottom, then select I'm not in this list. On the next page, it asks you to enter one of your friend's name or your birth month. Here I will enter one of my friend's name. After entering, tap continue. Now Facebook will suggest exactly your account. Now you can see several options. Here we don't have access to our email, phone number or any password. So tap no longer have access to this at the bottom. Here you can see what are the steps to recover your account. Let's go through these steps. First, you have to add your new login email. Don't provide any old email which you have already connected to 
another Facebook account. If you provide an all email address, they won't accept that. So now on, this will be your new primary email address. As well as Facebook will send you recovery link to this email address. Here enter your new email address like this. After that, tap confirm at the bottom. On the next page, you will see several options to verify you. Here I got only two. You will get more than this. Select any method which is more comfortable to you. As the first option, if you remember your old Facebook password, you are good to go with that thing. Another way, if you have your old mobile or email address, you can request a login code. If you have no any other method, you have upload a copy of one of your ID. So select upload ID option. Here you can see which type of IDs you can upload. If you tap see more, you can see all of them. If you don't have any of these IDs, you can upload any other official document like a utility bill. Select any ID that you have right now, then tap next. On the next page, you will get some instruction to get a copy of your ID. You can follow those. To go forward, tap get started. Here you have aligned your ID within the frames. Then it will automatically capture a photo of your ID. Then if you think this ID photo is readable or clear enough, you can tap submit at the bottom. Somehow it is not readable or blurry, you can read a photo. After tap submit. Here you can see your ID photo is uploading. Then you will get this notice. Facebook will review your account within 48 hours. Now you have to wait until Facebook contacts you to your new email address. After two days, you can check your email address which you provided earlier. Normally, they will respond to you within 24 hours. If you open your email at the top, there is an email from Facebook. If you open that, you can see this is the final step of recovering your account. They have already added your new email address. Now you have to enter your new password. To enter new password, tap reset password button. Then you will be redirected to another new page to secure your account. Then you have to go through a security check-in process to identify what are the changes has been made to your account? To begin, tap get started. Then you can see your check-in process is ongoing. Then it will show what are the changes have been made. You can see it asked to change my password and review email addresses. To go forward, tap continue. Then it asks you to Create a new strong password. Here set a strong password which includes upper letters, lower cases, numbers and symbol everything. After typing, tap continue. On the next page, it asks to change or remove your email addresses. If you can see here any new email address which has not been added by you, you can select that. Then tap continue to remove it. On the next page, it asks you to add your new email address. After entering new email address, tap add. On the next page, it says, thanks for taking time to secure your account. Now just tap, go to new speed. Now you have successfully recovered your hacked Facebook account. These are only two ways to recover your account just using your browser. There are another three methods. You can recover your hacked account using your Facebook, Facebook Lite or Messenger application. In some case, these two methods didn't work for you, you can try out other methods too. I will put that playlist and video links in this video description. Go and check it out. That's it. Later.